Hi everybody, it's me Libby, here from Tampa, and I just wanted to show you, I bought an Uncidium, and as you guys might know, or might not know, I only buy orchids no more than $7, I've never spent any more than that, and plus I got 15 rescues from a friend and out of the 15 14 have made it but this one i just bought yesterday for three dollars and i'm unpotting it so that i can pot it in new medium so here we go what i'm trying to do is break up this sphagnum moss because here in Tampa, Florida, you can't have this. It's all mushy. And with as much as it rains here, what I use, what I have all my orchids in, the ones that I have outside, they're all in lava rock and clay pots, which that's where I'm going to put this. So I'm going to go ahead and finish taking this out of the moss, and then I'll get back to you. Lava rock, clay pot, and oncidium, and I think it is just awesome. Here we go, and it's awesome. I hope I planted it right and that I would make Todd proud. Okay, folks, and this is my Catalea that Todd also brought to me because we traded uh, Nepenthes ventricosa. His name is Kool-Aid. And he was doing great. He had 10 new pictures and just a bunch of new leaves. But he was a little bit too much hassle for me because he did not like the water from my water hose. And he had to be watered every day. So I said goodbye to Kool-Aid and hello to my Catalea my oncinium and I'm going to leave her just like she is and put her in my little orchid garden. Bye guys, signing off from Tampa, Florida. It's Libby in my little garden.